because I'm the only one who can. The only one who cares enough. Well, I'm hanging on to the end of the rope with this, Nicole. I can't take much more. I've been really good up until now. I've been trying really hard. Well, it's not working, is it? The medication, the mood swings. Things are not getting better. You need to fix this. But it, it's not me, it's... I said enough! But I need you, Brett, please don't. I have a secret no one can see. No one but you and Jesus. Sometimes I feel there's a hedge around me. And no one can see. But Jesus. I feel I touch, but no one cares much. No one but you and Jesus. What a happening party last night, eh? With all the bosses. What time did you leave? What happened to you, Leslie? Uh, yeah, I saw you uh, knocking back the turps with Belinda and Graham. So? What? Well, did you get the promotion then? I've not got a yet. Oh, come on, mate. It's in the bag for you. What's this? What's in the bag? Um, Brett, he's going all shy about his obvious upcoming promotion. If you were there, Cindy, you saw it. Uh, I was there. Excuse me? Did I miss something? Uh, let's just um, say, uh, when there are state of mind issues within a family, <coughs> the bosses just don't like to hand out extra responsibility. That's all. you got to be kidding me. You deserve this, Brett. You've worked really hard at it. But... Oh, but what, Sonny? What? Uh, okay, don't get all defensive. Look, we all know the issues you have with Nicola. <coughs> And it's made so much worse because she works here with all of us. You know, oh, I know we feel so bad for you, we, we feel for you, but you know, it keeps interfering with our work. Well, you know what? It's interfering with your work. And I think it's about time you did something about it. Okay, now look, what I'm trying to say is that she. She's no she, good, broken, a weirdo. What do you want me to do? Fire her? No. Divorce her? No. Send her away. Yeah, I know. Tranquilize her. <laughs> of course not, Cindy. <laughs> um, but you have to admit she is affecting the people around here. Look, we don't know how to. We don't. We don't know how to handle her problems. And what can we do if she gets a little bit weird? <laughs> <laughs> Just not a good look. Brett, that's all I'm saying. Have a think about it, okay? Nicola has worked here longer than you, Cindy. <coughs> and everyone was fine until you knew about your problems. Now all of a sudden you can't handle her. We don't have the means to help. That's all I'm saying. Didn't need the means until you got wind of it. Mm. <laughs> you know, when I first met this pretty young thing you were going to marry. You were in a bit of a hurry. Hey, you couldn't wait to take her off the market. You know, she was young, sweet, and, and most of all, she loved you. Despite everyone telling her the real you, she, she loves you with all your flaws. I wish it was still that simple stuff. Well, I don't see how it suddenly got complicated. I mean, except you're getting hassled by a bunch of nervous, ignorant people that don't understand. You gotta do your job and defend her. Well, you're sure I know, but things have been getting. She's inconsistent with her meds, appointments. Loses about the smallest damn thing. Like last night, what she said was totally wrong. Well, she has to stick up for herself. If you won't, I mean. Well, Belinda has a right. Nicola has the same right, mate. Are you. Are you embarrassed that people know? 
Because don't fall in with them believing she's less than normal because she's a wonderfully gifted. Yeah, sure, I know. I, I'm not. I don't. Well, I just, I just don't know when you stopped believing, Greg. And when you started listening to what those schmucks think is right. <coughs> Remember what you used to tell each other. It's you and me against the world. So hang on tight. a bunch of no hopers sitting on the doll, bludging off the society, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> okay, and then what happened? Well, her husband tried to defend her, apparently, but she's a real, um, she's a real, um, whack job. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't know, maybe I just missed something, but I thought there was a pill they could take right? to stop being so crazy. Totally. Right? Okay, because I would actually just die if someone in my family was like that. Yeah. And to think she was working here Ew. with us. <laughs> like, you can throw all the money and the pearls at those people, but it just never makes a difference. I know. I mean... Lovely oh. tan, by the way. Hey! Thank you! <laughs> I mean, you know, because no one... I don't know much about blood, because why would I know about mental people? Oh, no way, yeah, totally. No, I don't know. I accept if I've been out to town and then like everyone's been buying okay. drinks. And my mum just like throws a mental. They're just for me. They just get really dark in here. <laughs> <laughs> the rest of the world. So hang on tight. 